Hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Kaylee and today we are going to do a 45 minute full body bar class. It's going to be really fun and we're going to use sliders for a lot of the class. So grab them if you have them or your towel, your socks, whatever you sub with. And as always, if you don't have, you can modify by just stepping the foot or hovering it, doing the same motion that we do with the slider, just without it. We're also going to use a chair and a light set of weights. I have three pounds here. You grab whatever works for you. There's a Spotify playlist in the description if you like music while we flow. And let's get started with a little warm up. Feet about hip width, soft bend in the knees. We're gonna start by taking the chin towards the chest and then roll the right ear to the right shoulder. Come back through center and switch. So standing up tall, think spine straight, soft bend in the knees, maybe you close the eyes here. Feels so good on the neck. Here's four, here's three, here's two, last one, chin back to center, eyes blink open, reach left arm overhead, big side body stretch, and then switch, right arm overhead. Reach, reach, good. Opening up through your obliques, serratus. Keep breathing. Four counts. Last two, last one, hands to the heart squat, down and stand, arms go back. Weight in the heels. Body weight squat to warm up. Starting to open the hips, wake up the legs. Leaning forward slightly. Here's four. Three, we'll hold it low. Two, one, hold it low. Little dips down. Eight, six, we'll jog the heels in four. In three, in two, in one. Right heel, lift, then left. Keep that little pulse. Right, left, right, left. Good, keep breathing. Right, left. Right, left. Here's four. Three, both heels down. In two, in one, heels down. Fold over the legs. Bend the knees. Straighten the legs. Come all the way back up to stand. Sweep the arms up. Again, fold. Bend, straighten, lift up. Good, couple more like that. Warming up the hamstrings, the back body. Spine feels good. You can always walk the hands all the way up the legs if that works better and then walk them back down if you're feeling a little bit tight. Good, couple more. Last four. Three, two, and one. Hold the fold, shake the head yes and no. Maybe make some circles. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. On your inhale, roll all the way up to stand. Sweep the arms up at the top. Exhale, hands to heart center. Take the feet wider than the hips now. You can roll out the mat if you need to. Heels and toes out. We're gonna reach the arms overhead as we squat low, and then arms come back down in front as we stand. <sighs> Opening the shoulders. Chest is broad. Weight in the heels. Beautiful. Couple more. Four counts. Four. Three. Two. One. Hold it low. Now reach left arm overhead, right arm in front, and then switch. And switch. Good. Stay low in the legs. Side bend. Side bend. Nice. Right arm, then left arm. Couple more, four counts, four, three, 
two, one, even out the sides. Come back through center, hands to the thighs, take a deep breath in. Breath out, dip your right shoulder down, gaze towards the left, stay low in the legs. Inhale through center, exhale, left shoulder down, gaze to the right. One more each side, inhale through center, exhale to twist. Inhale through center, exhale to twist. Good, inhale through center this time, exhale wide-legged forward fold, getting a little bit more into the inner thighs, drop the head. Take a deep breath in, and a deep breath out. Beautiful, inhale for a halfway lift on the exhale. Let's drop down onto the mat, however you get there. We're gonna start with core, so lay on your back. Bring one slider, actually both sliders with you. Sliders go underneath the feet. Heels on the sliders, if you don't have them, Again, you just mimic the movement with no sliders. All right, lay down. Hands are behind the head, elbows wide. Take the feet wider than the hips. We'll slide it in as we crunch, we'll go in for two and out for two. All right, dig the heels into your sliders. Right away, activating transverse core. Head is heavy in the hands, chin away from the chest. Good, lift. Lower, lift, lower. Really push into the sliders as you take them to center. In, in, yes, nice. Couple more. Eight counts, eight. Six, we'll keep it in, in four. Three, bend the knees to the chest, into one right here, knees in, knees out. And you're just holding the chest up, out. Push into your heels, out, and in, good. Four more, four. We're gonna take this up to a seat. We'll reach the arms overhead. As we bend the knees, we'll come up into In one, reset, arms overhead. So as we lift, we pull the sliders and reach the fingers towards the feet. As we lower, super slow, one vertebra at a time, come all the way back to the mat. Up, push, lower, lower. So the trick here is to try not to take the feet off of the sliders, really push into them. It will ignite your low core. I know you feel that, I definitely do. And when you lower, Try to lower slowly with control onto the back body. Down, up. My core is definitely on fire. Four, three, two, and one. Hold it up, now take the hands to the heart. Twist right as you lengthen the left leg. Come back through center and switch. Twist left as you lengthen the right leg. A Little bit faster, twist. Twist, twist, twist. So it's kind of like a Russian twist, bicycle combo. Push into the heels and try to tap opposite elbow to opposite knee. Good, twist, 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 twist. That looks awesome. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one, awesome job. All right, keep the sliders, come on up to a tabletop. One slider goes underneath the left hand, the other underneath the right foot. So you're on your mat, right hand and left knee support you. Left hand on your slider, right foot on your slider. Lengthen your right leg back, lengthen your left arm forward. Push into the sliders, we're gonna pull it in right here. So we'll go in for two and out for two. In, crunch, back, back. All right, push into the sliders. Feel your core. In, out, good. In, out. Starting to warm up the shoulders, the glutes a little bit. Out, in, 
out and in. Four counts. Four, three, two, one. Listen here. Lift the left knee. We're going to take right leg out, pull it back in, left arm out, pull it back in. So it's right, in, left, in, right, left. Woo! Keep breathing. Out, out. You're holding the left knee at a hover the whole time. Your modification is to drop it back down, alternate. One in, one in. Good. Push, push. You should really feel your right side obliques. Four, three, two, one. Listen here, drop the knees, left hand comes to your mat. We're just gonna slide right foot in, out, out, in. Here's four, three. We're gonna take right foot to the right. In two, in one, right here, take it back. We go out, out, then back. Back, right, back, right. If this feels pretty easy, option, left knee stays lifted. Out and back. So you're hovering left knee the whole time. Push into the hands. Again, feel your right side obliques. They should be talking to you. Here's four, three, two, and one. Leave the slider at the top of the mat. Drop the left knee, drop the right knee. Grab the sliders in the hands. Lay on the belly. Reach the fingers forward. Pull elbows in as you lift. Then lower. Pull. And press. All right, a little bit of a prone press. You're squeezing shoulder blades together. Chin is tucked in towards the chest. Lengthen the crown of the head forward. Push into the feet. Pull. All good. Working on our back muscles. So, so good for posture. A couple more. Pull. Pull. Eight counts. Eight. Six. Last four. We do that on the other side. Three. Two. One, right here, come on up. Find your tabletop, take one slider with you as you turn around. This time slider underneath the right hand, slider underneath the left foot. Take the arm and leg long, we pull it in, right here, in. And out, really push into the sliders, good. Think like a little crunch, especially for the left side obliques. In and out, use your core. You've got this, out and in, out, in, squeeze. Find that mind-muscle connection. This could feel really easy if you're not staying engaged. Eight counts, eight, seven, six, five, four. We're gonna lift the right knee in three, two, and one, listen here, keep it in, lift the knee, left leg out, left knee in, right leg or right arm other. So it's left leg in, right arm in, left, right, left, right, oh my goodness, left, right, left, right. The right knee stays hovering this whole time, out, out, four counts, four, three, two, and one. Drop the knees, reset, right hand down, left leg out, in, out, in. Good, keep going, out, in, out, in, all right, let's slide it left, right here, hold it, back slide, left, left, then back, back, left and back, keep going, left, and back. If you want a little extra, right knee up, left, back, push into the slider, left, back, squeeze it, out, and in, 
out, in, whoo, couple more, four, three, two, one, drop it down, awesome job. All right, keep one slider, you can place the other one off to the side for now. Grab your chair and one, wait, chair is going onto your mat. It will be your stable surface for the sequence. Slider goes underneath the right foot to start. All right, we're gonna start in a first position, heels in, toes out, weight in the right hand by the side. We'll slide it out to a second in four, three, two, one right here, out for two, and up for two. So you're sliding right foot out wide. You're lifting right arm in line with the shoulder. Soft bend in the right elbow the whole time. I need a deep bend in the knees, but keeping the bend when you come back up to first position when the heels tap. Keep breathing wherever you are. Spine straight, core engaged. You could always take out the weight as well and just do this with the arm or keep the right hand at your hip. If you don't have a slider, you're just stepping out to a wide squat. Good. You've got it. Left inner thigh should be talking to you. Out, in, whoo. Out, in. All right, couple more. Stay with me. Last four. Three, two, one. Hold it out. Weight to your right shoulder, left heel up, then down. Lift, lower. A right shoulder press as we lift the heel. So it's down, push, down, push. Left hand is supporting you if you want to balance. Left hand to hip, always an option. Press, press, good. Down, up, down, up. You've got this, four counts, four. Three, we hold the heel up, we dip straight down. In two, in one, right here, dip. Dips, so you're holding the arm overhead. You're still holding the chair if you would like to. Always, always, you could leave the hand at the hip. Extra balance, extra burn. Dip, dip, left inner thigh, whoo, dip, dip. Dip, dip, eight counts, eight, seven, six, Five, four, we tap the left thigh back, so we'll hold it low. In three, two, one, hold it low, tap back, push, push, push. Like you're trying to tap something right behind your left thigh. Tap, tap, all right, we're almost to the other side. Stay with it. Four, three, two, one, beautiful. Come on up, sweep the slider to the other side of your chair. Right hand supports you this time. Heels in, toes out, left foot on your slider. Bend into your knees, we take it out. Three, two, one, right here. Out, in, good. Out, and in, beautiful. Spine straight, core engaged. You tap the heels as you come up, try to keep the bend in the knees. And then you slide it wide. Right hand is supporting you. Soft bend in the left elbow. That will keep the elbow joint safe. You've got this. In, out, out, in. Good. Keep breathing. You've got this. Out, in. Yes, so, so good. Couple more, we hold it out, you've got this. 
eight counts, eight, six, four, three, two, and one. Hold it out, weight to your shoulder, right heel up, right heel down, lift, lower, lift, lower, spine straight, lift, lower, lift, lower, yes. So good, so good. Eight, six, we add the arm. Four, three, two, one, push it up. Lift, lower, lift, lower, woo. Hello, shoulder, push, push, push. Right heel is lifting, push, push, yes. You've got this. Eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five, four. We hold it up, we dip down. Three, two, one. Hold it up, little dips. Down, down, dip, dip. Right heel stays lifted. Dip, dip, dip. Four, three, we tap it back two, and one, hold it low, tap back, push, 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 tap, tap, tap with the right thigh, Whoo. tap, 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 push, 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 keep going, eight counts, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come on up to stand. Oh my goodness. Awesome job. All right, come to one side of your chair. Keep the weight and then grab the other weight. We're also keeping this slider, but we'll use it in just a second. So keep it towards the left side of your chair. All right, one weight. It's going behind the right knee. So we squeeze it there, left foot is going to support us. You could always do this body weight as well. Lean forward onto your chair, so forearms onto it. Right knee next to left to start, soft bend in the left knee. We're just gonna kick it straight back in four, three, two, one, right here, back and lower, back and lower, good. So you're kicking right foot back, down and up, good. You're squeezing your right glute, you're hinged forward, and your core is engaged so that it's supporting your back body as you lean forward. The chair is there to support you, so use it. Lift, lower. Think like you're kicking something above you with the right toes. Anytime we do this extension back behind us when the leg moves back past the spine, that's our glute max doing that movement. So you should feel the big fleshy part of your muscle, of your glute working. You could even put your hand there and feel it as you move. Back, forward, yes. So good, eight. Six. Four, three, we keep it lifted in two. In one, keep it lifted, little pulses. Up, up, squeeze that weight there. Lift, 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 good. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Whoo, you've got this. Eight counts, eight, seven, six, Five, we're gonna keep the knee lifted, turn the thigh out. In four, three, two, one, right here, turn out, turn down. Out, then down, so your hips stay square. You turn right knee out, then down. External rotation in the right femur. So you should feel your bone moving in your hip socket. Right, down, out, in. 
Oh my goodness. This one never gets easier. Out and keep squeezing that weight. We're almost done. Eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We keep it out little pulses. Two and one. Keep it out little pulses. Up. Up, so your hips are still square, but your right knee is pointing out slightly. Lift, lift, here's four. Three, we're gonna grab that weight. Slider goes underneath the left foot right here. Grab the weight, put, put both of the weights in your right hand slider. Left foot, left hand to your chair. We're gonna slide it back into a lunge. Bend into the right knee as you slide. Pull back up, still using right glute. Weights are there for extra resistance. Push into your right heel. Slide in, slide back. Yes, so good, so hard. Eight, six. We add a bicep curl in four, three, two, one as you slide, curl, lower, curl, lower, so strong. Deep bend in the right knee as you slide back. Couple more, eight, six, we hold it back, four, Three, we'll keep the bend in the right knee. Pull left knee in fast. Hold the weights at the shoulder so it's in, out. Pumping left knee into the chest. Most of your weight is in your right foot. Left hand is still supporting you. Whoo! Right glute. Eight, seven, six, and we get to switch sides. In four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. Come on up to stand. Whoo! Weights go down on your chair as you transition to the other side. Awesome work. All right, slider over to the right side. Weight behind left knee. Squeeze it. The other weight is just hanging out on your chair, so we need it. Lean forward, forearms onto the chair. Soft bend in the right knee, kick it back up and back. Lift, lower, all right. Try to find the mind muscle connection to your left side. You might still be feeling your right side, that's totally normal. But can you put your attention on your left glute now? Lift, lower. That helps me when I'm transitioning sides especially when we do these quicker transitions. As always, if you need to take a break at any time in my class, you are more than welcome to take a break. You know your body best. And the reason why we come to practice, to work out, to grow stronger, that underlying purpose is just to get to know ourselves and listen to our body. Lift, lower. And even if we don't think about it, right? We don't go, oh, we're gonna go do a workout class so that we can get to know ourselves better. But that is really what we're doing here in these moments. Good. Lift, lower, squeeze that weight. Lift, lower. All right, let's keep it lifted. We'll pulse it. Right here, little lift, little lift, keep squeezing, little lift, up, up, lift, lift, oh my goodness, lift, lift, eight counts, eight, six, four counts, four, three, we turn it out, then down, in two, in one, right here, out, down, out, down, wide, 
center, yes. Out, down, external rotation. Out, down. Four counts, four, three. We pulse it out into. In one, hold it out, little pulses. Lift, lift, lift. All right, last push for this standing. One leg, we're moving to our lunge. In four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, grab that weight, place it on the chair as you transition. Right foot slider, both weights, left hand, slide it back. Slide it up, slide it back. Slide it up, deep, deep bend in the left knee. My glute is absolutely on fire right now. You're getting low in your lunge. You're digging your left heel into the floor. Chest stays broad here. Let's add that curl. Keep breathing. Keep pushing. You've got this. Also telling myself that. <laughs> Back, forward. I truly am right here with you. I'm feeling it just as much as you are. Good. Couple more. Last one. Hold it back. Weight at your shoulder. Pump right knee. Out, in, out, in. This is the killer. Stay low in your left leg. That's the key. Right knee. Out, in, out, in. Final push. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Stand up. Woo. Awesome job. All right. Chair off to the side. Weights off to the side for now. Actually, bring them to your mat with you. We're going to use one slider, but keep both of them close by. So, left hip is down. Right leg goes straight out. Left hand on your slider. Right hand down in front of you. We're going to slide it down and then slide it back up. Down, up, so you're pushing into the slider. A little bit of obliques. Down, up, good. Right hand is supporting you. Here's four, three, two, one. Add the right arm overhead, so you slide out, slide in, slide out. Slide in. So if that's way too hard for you, keep the right hand down in front of you. Good. Let's add the right knee in. Out. In. Yes. Squeeze. Squeeze. So, so good. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, we hold it out, little pulses, in two, in one, hold it out, little lifts, arm and leg, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, awesome job, come on up, slide that slider over to the right side, come on to your right hip now, right knee is bent, Left leg long, right hand to your slider, left hand in front, slide it out, out, in, out, in. So you should feel this in your serratus, down into your obliques, into your lat on your back, and also your tricep a little bit. Also a little massage for the bottom hip. Mine feel very sore already from that last glute sequence. All right, let's add the arm overhead. So we'll slide out, pull, slide, pull. Good, squeezing obliques, out, pull. Beautiful, out, 
pull. Let's add the knee. Out, squeeze. Again, you can always go back to the first version if this is too hard. Listen to your body wherever you are. Squeeze, squeeze, eight, six, we hold it out, four, three, two, and one, hold it out, little pulses, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, beautiful, awesome work. All right, lay onto your back. Keep the slider by your right foot. We are laying all the way down. Head can rest. Slider underneath the right foot. Left heel lifts. We're gonna start with just a bridge. Four, three, two, one. We go, hips up, hips down. Arms are by the sides, up. Down, think squeezing left glute. Up, down, <sighs> lift, or squeezing both glutes, but especially your left. Up, up. Notice what the heel lifted feels like. Maybe you can get a little bit higher. You can stay a little bit more engaged because it gives us more space. If our heel was down, it would be a little bit harder to get up as high. And we're not going for height necessarily, but it is a different sensation than with both heels down. Here's four. Three. As we lift, we'll slide the right foot out into, and once you go, lift, slide, pull. Lift, slide, pull. So right leg goes out as you slide, as you lift, push, pull. <sighs> really feeling my left glute right now. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We keep it out, little pulses. Right here, keep it out. Lift, lift. So the right leg is straight ish. Lift, lift, lift. Eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five, last four. Three, we're gonna roll to our left side in two, in one, right here. Keep the slider underneath the right foot. Sit up, roll over to your left side, left knee down, right hand by the head. We're gonna lift the hips and then lower back down. Hips up, hips down. So right foot still is the slider. You're lifting the hips up into a side plank. Four counts, four. Three, two, and one. Keep it lifted now. Curl. Right knee, right elbow in front of you. Extend it out long. Curl. Extend. Hips stay lifted here. Little crunch for your lateral obliques. Good. Pull. Extend. Nice. Eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five. Last four, then we get to switch sides. Three, two, one. Right here, lower down. Sit up, sweep the feet around. Bring your slider with you. Lay onto the back. Left foot has the slider now. Right heel lifted. Head heavy, hands by the sides, hips up and down right here, hips up, hips down. Lift, lower, you're pushing into the left heel, you're pushing into the right foot. Try to bring more weight into your right glute than your left. Good, up, down, lift, lower. So beautiful, up, down, lift, lower. Up, down, up, down, eight, six. Here's four, we slide left foot out as we lift. 
in three, in two, in one. Right here, lift, slide, pull. Lift, slide, pull. Lift, lower, lift, lower. Yes. Push, pull, push, pull. Out, out. Push, push, good. Eight, six, we pulse it in four, three, two, one. Right here, keep it lifted, little pulses. Left leg is straight-ish. Squeeze your right glute as much as you can. Lift, lift. Here's four, we roll to the right side in three, in two, in one. Right here, lower the hips, roll to your right side, right forearm down, right knee down. Same thing, left hand behind the head. Lift the hips up and down. You might have to readjust where you are on your right hip. I also still want you to feel your right glute. It's supporting you now as you lift the hips up. Good, lift. Lift. Four counts, we pulse. Four, three, two, and one, keep it lifted, pulse up and up. Lift and left, right, we slide left foot in front. In three, two, one, right here, elbow to knee. Extend it long. Elbow to knee, extend it long, good. Curl, press, curl, press. Little crunch forward. Keep the hips lifted if you can. Keep pushing into your right forearm. Almost there. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful work. Drop it down. Awesome job. Move the slider off to the side. Let's lay onto our back. We will finish with a little bit of core. Grab the weights on your way down. Let the head be heavy. Weights in either hand, and then reach them overhead. Slide the biceps close towards the face. Tailbone drops, legs lift to a tabletop. We bend the elbows right here. Bend, extend, finishing with triceps. Transverse core, bend, extend. I like to press my weights together. But if you like to keep them shoulder width distance, that's a great place to be as well. Bend, extend. You'll start to feel your triceps or the back side of the arms. Bend, extend, bend, extend. Good. Four, three. As we straighten the arms, we'll alternate lowering the legs right here, right leg out, left, out, in. Yes, right, left, right, left, both legs together, out, in, out, in. Always the option to stay with the alternating, that's your modification. <sighs> Belly button to spine, natural curve in your low back. So you're not overarching, but you're not pushing the low back into the mat either. You're trying to hold in your neutral spine. Four, three, we keep everything bent, just pulse the elbows. Two, one, right here, little lift, little lift, tiny press, yes. Up and up, up and up, yes, up, lift, push. Yes, 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 eight counts, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, now listen here, lift the arms overhead, fly the arms wide, bend the elbows, lift up. So soft bend the elbows. Eight, seven, six, five, we'll add one leg at a time in four, three, two, and one as we fly left leg out, in switch, out, in, left, 
right. Keep breathing. You've got this. Eight counts, eight. Six, we'll finish with both legs. Four counts, four, three, two, one. Both legs out, in, out, in. Whoo, so close. Last four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, come back through center, drop the feet, reach the weights by the side. Arms lift overhead, take a deep breath in. And a deep breath out, let it go. Start to windshield vapor the legs side to side. Arms can stay overhead or come down by the sides. Nice work. One more breath in. And breath out. Beautiful. Draw the knees back in through center. Take them wide. Happy baby. Soles the feet to the sky. Drop the tailbone down. Maybe close the eyes again. Maybe you keep them closed for the rest of class. Beautiful. Gently draw the knees into the chest. Rock yourself up to a seat and transition to a tabletop. We'll take a few cat cows. On your inhale, start to drop the belly, lift the tailbone, lift the gaze. And exhale, tuck round, push into the hands, arch the back, chin towards chest. Again, inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat round. Last round. Beautiful, coming back through center, come to cross-legged, or you can sit up on the knees. Let's reach the right arm by the right side, left arm over the ear, and then switch. Left arm to the left, right arm over the ear. Side to side a few times. And then this time, twist to the right, left hand, right thigh, right hand behind you. And move back through center and switch. Right hand, left thigh, left hand behind you. And then move back through center, take the legs out long. Come into a straddle, flex the feet, take a big breath in. On the breath out, walk yourself forward, folding in between the legs. Beautiful, come back up through center. Use the hands to help pull the knees back in and you are done. Awesome job, I hope you loved this class. Please let me know in the comments below if you did, what kind of classes you would like to see more of. Give the channel a subscribe and like and yeah, I will see you in my next video, bye.